everyone welcome back to my channel from the last time that I already reviewed the best shaper of the Chanel wallet on chain this one here and I said that the side of the base shaper is sticking out and it keeps the side of the bag bulging out I already adjust the shape of it with the clipper just like this here it's kind of a DIY project just like this it, I keep it like this for almost three days now and it become caving inside like this so it's better but I try to put some stuff in my bag and the stuff is pushing the side of this bed shaper out again so the bulging out problem isn't slow anyway but this morning I read one comment from Miss Hula Girl thank you so much for your idea she recommended me to DIY the bed shaper by myself she said that she used to have the bed shaper just like me and then she DIY by herself by using the box paper which is a little bit uh, thicker than the, more, than the normal paper but I don't have the box paper at my home in this morning but I have the future board I will show you here this is what it looks like I'm not sure they call the future board in English or not but in Thailand they call it future board the uh, plastic board that you use it for the science project or the art project like, like that I will insert the picture of what it looks like if you don't have uh, if you have no idea what I talk about <laughs> okay so it come out like this I cut out the piece of the future board and then I wrap it with the colorful tape just like this here so you can see it become like this and the corner of the bed shaper I cut it into the round shape so it won't scratch inside of the bag like this okay the pro of this DIY base shaper is first it's safe for your money <laughs> because in Thailand the future board is very cheap and you can find it anywhere in the stationery store and also this tape is like very very cheap so it doesn't cost much comparing to this one it's cost quite a bit okay and the second pro is it is lightweight here it doesn't have any weight to it <laughs> like this and the third pro is you can adjust the side of the bed shaper by yourself for me I use the side of this bed shaper but I cut it out a little bit smaller so it won't stretch the back too much here okay so let's try putting it inside the back okay this is my Chanel wallet on chain you can see the base of the bag is now look like this okay then let's put it inside okay now inside of the bag look like this you can use any color if you can find the burgundy color it will become like just like the interior of the bag but I just have the pink tape <laughs> just like this so it look a little bit colorful inside now okay and you can see the side is looking good without any bulging out anymore here this is another side and this is the bottom and you can see it stretch out neatly here just like this okay and then let's try put some stuff inside the bag first I have this pouch it contains my nose and also my coins I will put inside the bag uh, actually you can put some nose or bill inside this zipper pocket 
but I don't want to switch my stock much so I just put it inside this pouch here it looks like this and the next thing is my Calvi card holder like this and my airpods like this okay my air oil control theme here and I will put some alcohol spray inside here now it looks like this I won't put any lipstick inside because uh, the space is kind of full now and I don't want to stretch the back too much okay try to close it see it doesn't have any bulgy anymore here and the bottom is looking good here <laughs> this is the perfect base shaper for me I wish Miss Hulaka would have told me before <laughs> before I bought this one because from using this DIY base shaper I won't use this one anymore <laughs> Okay, now it looks like this. So, it depends on your preference. If you don't like to DIY anything by yourself, I still recommend using this one, but you have to adjust a little bit of the side of the bed shaper. But if you have the DIY spirit inside of you, <laughs> just like me, I recommend this DIY bed shaper. It's cheaper, it's lighter, and also prettier. <laughs> okay, that's it for today, you guys. If you have any questions, please comment down below. And please don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell. And also give me a thumbs up. And see you next time, you guys. Bye.